enjoy. If those meatballs don't make you feel good, I don't know what will. I am not your therapist. I thought I was clear on that point. I know, I know, I'm sorry. I've cooked your favorite food. I'm playing your favorite music. I've done everything you asked me to do. Oh, not you again. That's mine. Is it? Because it fits the description of one that was taken in a street robbery last night just round the corner. Does that ring any bells? Oh, I found it. On the path. I thought it'd make a nice pillow. Oh, and funnily enough, all the money's gone. It was empty when I found it. Really? Because it looks like you've had a nice little party. I said it were empty. Are you deaf? I was mugged by somebody with a slight figure wearing a dark hoodie. Oh, well, that narrows it down, doesn't it? I've read your contract in detail, and there are a number of issues that we need to discuss. We are a global brand with offices in over 45 countries. Truthfully, your company would benefit from working with us. So I think it's perfectly reasonable to ask for a lower price in the deal. If you want the best, then it comes at a cost. I'm here to try and make a deal, Caro. So, let's make a deal. I can do just don't want you condone condone what you said. In that case, how about another? <laughs> <laughs> Have you ever been raped? But no one believes you. Have you ever been locked in a prison cell without trial and left to rot away? Have you ever lost the one person you truly loved in such a way that will punish you for the rest of your life? No. And yet, your life is unbearable. The truth is that people like you like swimming in your own shit. You wake up in the morning and all you can see is a swimming pool full of your own shit. And you decide to jump in and float around in it. And then you wonder why you feel like shit. Your choice. Take up the glass. One day, you will thank me. Take up the glass.